Hello everyone, I am Anne and this is Anne Makes. Welcome. Please, uh, if you are new here, I would so appreciate it if you subscribe to this channel. Uh, you can do so by clicking on the subscribe button below, clicking on the Anne Makes in the bottom corner of your screen. And also, please hit that bell and that way you'll be notified every time I post a new video. And on this channel, you will find different kinds of videos. There's a lot of haul videos because I am a professional collector of arts and craft supplies. And <laughs> I, uh, I love to uh, buy supplies for all the projects that I have in my head. I don't have enough time to make all those projects, but I certainly do try. I will also review products that companies send me uh, because uh, they do. companies do send me a lot of products because I work with different manufacturers. I actually work in the field and I, am also, I often have to make projects for certain assignments and I also get lots of pro lots of products to draw to try out, and I review them. So that is a, lo a lot of what you'll find on this channel. Of course, some projects and DIYs and how tos. So today, I have a small Dollar Tree haul to share with you. I needed some certain items, so I went into Dollar Tree to get them, and of course I looked at a few other things. So nothing too exciting, I'm sorry to say, but I picked up this cardboard presentation board. These are fabulous if you have uh, children in school, even if you are in uh, college. I remember having to use some of these for uh, presentations. They're great for making presentations. Uh, another thing that I think they are suitable for is to use as a white backdrop if you are shooting video or you are taking photographs. Especially if you are taking, you, you need to take uh, really nice photographs to post on your blog, on your Instagram, or whatever social media you are partaking in, and you need to have just the right amount of light and stuff. So this is helpful, or you need to hide something that would be in the background. So for a dollar twenty-five, because I am in Canada and Dollar Tree items are dollar twenty-five for us, um, I think it's worth it. I also picked up this shower curtain. I don't need it for a shower curtain. I just have bought several of these in the past and I continue to buy them either to use as drop cloths or to use as backdrops for filming and photography. So, um, sorry, I got a little distracted there because I see a message going across on my screen. And this is why I get them, and that's why I got this one. I, I wanted uh, one of these to use as a drop cloth for working on a project. I picked up a few of these frames, these silver frames, for a friend who has been looking for these. And these are the 5 by 7 And I, this one, the package is a little torn. Seems to be okay. This one also is okay, but this one I just noticed it has a scratch on it. Ugh. Um, yeah, hopefully uh, we could hide that scratch if my friend is in desperate need of uh, this one. Uh, if not, well, you know, I'll just reuse it somehow. I also picked up another package of these art sponges from the Color Factory brand. Uh, these are great for wetting down watercolor paper for watercolor painting and but they have all sorts of uses as well but uh, this is what I'll be using these for. I One of the things I I also needed from Dollar Tree were some trash bags. Ooh, how exciting that is and these are not for a craft project. They are for trash. <laughs> so, got those. And I picked up some more socks for hubby because he was very pleased with the socks I got the last time. So I was very surprised. And so I just picked up a few more pairs that they had at our Dollar Tree. So I got him this pair. And these are a brand. They are 100% cotton. 
and they, uh, well, it says cotton. They, I don't know if they're 100% cotton. I can't read. The print is too small for me. Um, but uh, they have cotton, and they have this one, which I didn't get the last time. Also, this color. Now, my camera is adjusting. There we go. This color or design. And then this one. So, he told me that he, he wears colored socks sometimes, so that's why I picked them up. Because I thought he wouldn't wear them at first, but he said he might. So, oh well. And I got some more of these little craft cups from Craft Medley. These are the tiny little clear acrylic storage cups. They're perfect for small amounts of paint, small amounts of glue, little those uh, fine glitters that they sell at Dollar Tree fit in here too. You know, you can put all sorts of sequins, beads, whatever you have uh, for your craft room. You could use these in your sewing room and you could use them in the garage. You could use them wherever you need to store little items. So, I got that. And I picked up this package of magnetic buttons because um, I have some metal paint palettes for watercolor where the the inside compartment is removable and it holds with magnetics magnets but there's one paint palette that I have that the, mag the magnets are not very strong and the the paints tend to fall out so I just thought I would reinforce that palette with some extra little magnets I also picked up this bottle of fabric glue because I don't think I've ever tried the fabric glue from Craft Medley. So, uh, yeah, I wanted to give this a try. And I also picked up a package of the Color Factory watercolor pencils, again, because I have not tried these. I do not have these in my stash, so I wanted to give these a try. Another thing that I think is new at Dollarama, or maybe it's just out because of the new the school supplies are being put out, are these dry erase markers in these really fun colors. So you get four in this pack, and I think they have a pretty, yeah, they do have a nice pointed tip, so they're nice to write with on a whiteboard. So I've got that. I also picked up a package of placards, not no, not remembering that I had already hauled a pack a couple weeks ago in this forgotten bag of mine that I had in the corner of my studio, and I just filmed <laughs> that belated haul video uh, this morning, earlier, today, this afternoon. Okay, earlier this afternoon. And last but not least, I got some of these jubes. Some of these jubes. It's a big bag. So there's 385 grams. This is a pretty decent size bag of jubes. The real jubes. The red ones. They are yummy. They are sweet. They are sticky. Hence the placards. <laughs> So that is it for my Dollar Tree haul. It was short, it was sweet, uh, but uh, that's all there is to say about that, folks. I hope you are having a wonderful day. I hope you're enjoying our summer. And I, I would appreciate a like, a comment, a share. Please subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Until next time, have fun, take care of yourself. Bye!